بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم سو ٹوڈے وی ول ڈسکس دا پراپرٹیز آف ویرینس اینڈ اسٹینڈرڈ ڈیویشن وچ از اے میجر آف ڈسپرجن سو ان دس لیکچر وی ول ڈسکس دا ڈفرینٹ پراپرٹیز آف ویرینس بٹ اٹ ول انکلوڈ ان فیو ادر ویڈیوز بیکاز here we will discuss only the first property of variance and standard deviation so what is the first property of variance and standard deviation the variance and standard deviation of a constant is equal to zero so if we consider any number generally we consider here a but any number but if there is no variability among the all observation so the variance for that data set and the standard deviation for that data set will zero amount of variability now we need to prove this property using a simple example so now let us consider a very simple example that is we have a data set of five observation 4 4 4 4 and 4 is it clear that there is no variability exist among the variables we can consider any numbers if that is 5 5 5 or 1000 1000 1000 but it will all the same observation so now here we consider just a simple example that a 5 observation which have the value 4 with no variability now we find variance and standard deviation to prove that variance and standard deviation of constant is zero so first of all we will find the arithmetic mean that is x bar so sum of the all observation is 20 and divide by the number of all observation 5 so the result is 4 now the first column include all the observation in second column now we will complete the requirement for the equation so x minus x bar so we will subtract arithmetic mean from all of the observation and it as the all observation and the arithmetic mean is same so it provide all zeros if we take squares of all zeros of course it will provide again zeros so the sum of x minus x bar whole square that is the square of all deviation taken from the arithmetic mean is zero so now if we put this in the equation of the variance s square is equal to sum of deviation from arithmetic mean that x bar minus x bar whole square divided by n so zero divided by five is zero and as the uh, standard deviation is the square root of the variance so again it will provide us a zero result now we have uh, another an alternative uh, uh, rule for finding the variance and standard deviation so let's try that what result give uh, that equation to us that is the second uh, method to find the variance and standard deviation so the first column is x which uh, include all the observations and the second column is the squares of all the observation that x square so 4 square is 16 4 square is 16 so the first column the sum of x is 20 and the second column sum of x square is equal to 80 now we use the equation that variance is square is equal to sum of x square divided by n minus sum of x divided by n whole square now we put all these values in this equation and find the solution so as the sum of x square in the previous slide was 80 so 80 divided by 5 minus 20 divided by 5 whole square so 16 minus 16 and variance s square is equal to 0 and the standard deviation is a zero square root is 0 hence this is proved that if there is no variability exist 
among the observation or among the values of the data set so there will be a zero variance and standard deviation for that data set and this is the property number one inshallah in next video we will discuss the other properties of the variance and standard deviation thank you very much thanks for watching assalamu alaikum